Since we bought a Glowforge, um, it's funny how quickly everything changed. At this point in time, every single door that we make, there are hundreds of varieties of doors, and that's all because of the Glowforge, because now we have the ability to carve, embed, change, make cuts that we can't make with our own hands, and make choices that we can both render as a smaller pixie door or a larger fairy door. These designs have impacted every aspect of our business. There isn't one door that we make now that isn't at least partially using the Glowforge to create. That's true. Welcome to Blue Toucan Studios. I'm Chris Pallas. I'm Kevin Serwacki. And we make fairy doors. Fairy doors are uh, an ancient European tradition where people would make small doors that they'd leave outside their house or just inside of it to encourage uh, the fae and other creatures of the forest to be friendly to them, to let them know that they were on their side. So ours are often used in gardens, but they're also found in all the little nooks and crannies of people's houses. It's, it's the kind of thing where people want to bring a little magic into their everyday lives. I knew exactly what I wanted to do with the Glowforge when we got it. Yeah. And at the time, uh, we were experimenting with robotic animals that we were putting on the fronts of our doors. They turned out to be popular, people liked them, but I was hand cutting every single part. And so when we bought it, that's what it was going to do. But if we knew then, what we know now, is that it's just the tiniest fraction of what we do with our Glowforge. And it has allowed us to do things where we have an idea, and normally it would never even leave the sketching phase, because when you have an idea like that, you, you have so much other work to do, you just don't have the time. But when you have a device like the Glowforge, you can take this design and you can then just run it on the Glowforge just to see how it's going to look. Which means you can take a lot more risks and you're not, you're not risking dozens and dozens of hours. Sometimes you're just risking a few minutes just to try something else. One of the best things about a Glowforge for us is not only do we, can we use it to make beautiful things, but it's just the two of us in the studio and the Glowforge is a third member of the team. Now, we make the design, we pass it over to the Glowforge, and it sits there working on our design while we get to move on to another project. 